People who cannot focus often have a do more boss. In other words, they have a boss who is unfocused. And that boss gives the person too many tasks, too many priorities. So what you need to do is to push back on your boss. Now you need to learn how to say no appropriately. The reason you're saying no to more assignments from your boss is not because you want to be a slacker. It is because you want to concentrate on those few key activities that matters the most in order to drive performance. And you cannot do so if you're getting more and more assignments onto your in-mail. The second reason that people cannot focus is because they give in to temptations. They are easily distracted. There are all those interesting things going on in the office. There is that email or that text. There's all these pings. And you sort of cannot pay attention to what really is in front of you. What you need to do is to set up rules ahead of time so that when those temptations come along, you're not going to be tempted and go and pay attention to them. Give an example. When I was writing this book, I got easily distracted by everything else going on. So I took an old computer and I stripped it down, took away all the software, all the email, all the text systems, and was left with only one thing, the word processing system. And then I went to a coffee shop and I was sitting there with my barren computer and writing my book. And soon enough, I got tempted by those emails and those text messages. But I couldn't access them because they were not on my computer. So I'd forced myself to concentrate on writing the book. And so I did. You too can come up with ideas like that. You can come into the office at an, an hour early so no one else can disrupt you. You can put on a set of headphones so no one can interrupt you. You can maybe find a quiet place in the office away from everybody else. So now you're creating a space for yourself to really concentrate. If you can manage your boss and your set of priorities and have a set of rules for not giving in to temptations, you will have a much better chance of really focusing and obsessing over the key things that you need to get done.